Well, today we are in Temecula, California, taking a look at different real estate. We've looked at a whole bunch of bank REOs, and now we ended up in uh, some new homes in Wolf Creek. We're going to take a look at them. All right, let's go take a look inside. Now we're in the family room. Let's go take a look at the kitchen and downstairs master. Wait a second, let me pan through. Okay, it's very narrow, very narrow as you can house. see. It's sort of like a double wide mobile home. But what is nicer is a downstairs master with a little interior courtyard off to the left and then a full bath over here. It's a nice bathroom, but it's <laughs> facing the street, so unless you want to be flashing your neighbors, you really can't open these windows. <laughs> That's right. All right, let's go take a look at the kitchen. All right. We have some pretty nice upgrades, pretty nice slab granite, a uh, little eating area. It's sort of like a detached townhouse feel. Doesn't necessarily feel like a home. We've been looking at homes today that were uh, bank REO that were probably twice the square footage and about 100000 less. They were asking about two seventy-five to 300000 for this house. Uh, with these upgrades, it's probably more. <laughs> and the homes we've seen out here that were built in the last 10, 15 years are in the seventeen to 2500 square foot range. They're running anywhere from 175 to, let's say, 250. All right, we're upstairs. There's a pretty nice upstairs family room is what we'll call it. Maybe a, a loft or a landing. But it is the full width of the house, so you can see that we're only talking 20 feet here. And there's, you know, five feet on either side. It really just has that detached townhome feel. Let's go take a look at the other bedrooms. Little computer nook, office nook here, off to the right. Hallway bath. Tiles. Yeah. And then two actually reasonably decent sized secondary bedrooms. Probably 10 feet by maybe 14. And of course, we have the upstairs laundry room. Pretty popular these days. Of course, with the master down, I guess that means you are coming upstairs to do your laundry. And then a hallway closet right behind you. And that's it. But you know, by the time you're in this house, you're going to be in for three, three fifty with some upgrades. Yeah, that seems kind of pricey. It seems way too pricey because today we've seen some properties that are probably 10, 15 years old that you could get for two hundred thousand dollars and maybe put ten into it, five to ten with new paint, new carpet, you know, cleaning it up, um, new new landscape, and you'd have you know not twice the house, but maybe another half house for. 100,000 less. So, all right, let's head to the next property.